business. Let's dive into the fascinating world of cryptozoology. And no, it has nothing to do with crypto. Cryptozoology is a pseudoscience and subculture that searches for and studies unknown, legendary or extinct animals, whose present existence is disputed or not confirmed, particularly those popular in folklore, such as Bigfoot, the Loch Ness Monster, or in this case, Chupacabra. So let's explore the mystery of Chupacabra, the creature that has been a subject of intrigue and speculation for decades. The Chupacabra, also known as a goat sucker, is a creature from folklore that is said to prey on livestock, particularly goats and other small animals, by draining their blood. Reports of the Chupacabra first emerged in 1990s, primarily in Latin American countries and the southwestern United States. Since then, there had been numerous alleged sightings and encounters, each with its own unique details and descriptions. Descriptions of the Chupacabra is very widely, but it is often described as a strange mix of different animals. Some accounts describe it as a reptilian creature with scaly skin, while others claim it resembles a cannon or even an extraterrestrial being. It is said it has large growing red eyes, sharp fangs and sometimes wings, or the ability to fly. These varying descriptions have led to much speculation about its origins and characteristics. The name Chupacabra is derived from Spanish words chupar meaning to suck and cabra meaning goat. This name reflects the creature's alleged feeding habits as it is said to leave puncture wounds on the necks of its prey and drain their blood. In some cases, the animals are found completely drained of blood, left in terrible and mysterious scenes that have baffled locals and investigators for quite some time. There are many so-called sighting videos of this creature walking by the houses, farmlands at night, but unfortunately many of those are just a result of computer magic or in another case some blurry footage of coyote or even a dog. Despite the many reports and sightings, there is no scientific evidence to support the existence of a chupacabra. Skeptics attribute the sightings to misidentification of known animals with mange a condition that can cause a hair loss and a sickly appearance. Coyotes, dogs and wildcats are often pointed as to be likely culprits behind chupacabra sightings. However, believers in the chupacabra legend maintain that there may be unknown species or creatures that have yet to be scientifically documented. The chupacabra has also made its way into popular culture appearing in books, movies and other media. Its mystic and elusiveness have captured the imaginations of many, leading to a variety of theories and speculation about its behavior and motives. Some believe it to be a malicious creature that preys on livestock out sheer bloodlust, while others think it may be a misunderstood animal trying to survive in changing environments. One of the most intriguing aspects of the Chupacabra legend it is a cultural significance. In Latin American countries where the legend originated, the Chupacabra has become a part of local folklore and traditions. It has been interrogated into stories, art and even celebration, adding a layer of cultural richness to its mythology. As with many cryptozoological mysteries, the chupacabra continues to be a subject of debate and speculation among believers and skeptics alike. While there is no definitive proof of its existence, the legend of the chupacabra remains a captivating mystery that continues to fascinate and intrigue those who are curious about the unknown. So, the chupacabra is a legendary creature that has captivated the imagination of many around the world. Whether it is a real cryptid or a product of folklore and misconceptions or something else entirely, the chupacabra continues to be a fascinating subject for exploration and discussion. So this is the mystery of chupacabra. We will keep our eyes open to capture any of nature's surprises. Thanks for watching.